In Russia, there was a holiday which was called Reparents. All things in hands of the master can really get new, even more interesting than former life. Today we reconstruct an old coat. We use the method allowing you creatively to change the fabric having defects. Instead of the old structure with the changed fibers, we will have, for example, color open work and instead of set colors, cheerful spots. Don't hasten to throw away the old things. They will please you more than once. We are simply sure of it. Hello, dear viewers. Today we will think that at times old friends and old wine are best. I have many old things, which I want to restore a little, because sometimes the old coal can become maybe even more interesting than it was initially. We can change not only the design, but also the fabric pattern to make the changes and to breathe in the new thing by our own hands, new soul. So, we give the second life to the old coat. Sometimes the coat is very good, in good condition. It's not necessary to cut it out again. It's possible to make some changes to meet the spirit of the day and maybe just to cheer yourself up. So, the first that I want to offer you is to remember one wonderful proverb from the dictionary, from the live great Russian dictionary of Vladimir Dal that the Tsar, the sovereign, patches the cities himself. To patch is means to repair, in other words, restore, reconstruct, because the word the patch has the same root. I will show you how it's possible to make by means of very simple method an art patch on an old coat. Pay attention, I have an old clause. On it there was a small defect. When I have cut out the details, it has turned out that in the center the fabric was very old and it has changed the coloring. I have decided to make here a patch. I've cut out a hole of the form necessary to me, have removed the middle and have put more durable element, but have put very skillfully. Look at the product wrong side. It's as though built in the fabric construction. You inlay a thick woolen cloth in a thick woolen cloth. It's very simple. Now we will make such patch, but here on such fabric. Together with you, I will transform the upper side into the spotted clothes. At first we will indent a pattern with a chuck. Then we'll cut the holes using the sharp scissors, but the fabric which we'll remove we can use for its appliance somewhere else. Keep the rests, don't throw them out. The cotton fabric had the sickness, and due to this sickness we already know the bayonet seam, we have mastered it in one of our master classes, but now we won't connect the details, but to use for an art patch. So, the algorithm of actions. At first, we take a chalk and any form which we don't need. I have decided that I will have the spotted clothes, the textile thick clothes piece. I outline the form necessary to me on the fabric. Then, I take sharp scissors and cut out the applying pattern. I remove the fabric. Then I take the same element, but from the fabric which we'll put. Here there is a small cunning. If you use a fabric, it will be necessary to make it with some stock, literally on half a millimeter more than your patch, as though enter it and will be strong enough. That the fabric with which we work won't pull together. Further, you work into stages. At first, you fill the surface with the bayonet seam from the wrong side and then repeat all from the upper. Then, you take the brush or a pin and you mask fibers. You will need to cover the seam fibers. And you have the handmade new fabric 
maybe even better than that variant which was originally.
And one more small advice. It's unimportant what form is your patch. Let it will be sharp or any refined form. Maybe it's a narrow crack. This technique is subject to any form. You can remove this detail and you can combine the most different elements because, as you see, the patch consists of three pieces of the thick woolen cloth. In other words, the patch can be not one piece, but enough multicolor and rich. And by the way, ideas of the grandmother's chest are inexhaustible. For example, one of ideas how to green scissors. My grandmother made it so. She took a usual needle and a few scissors and cut the needle. Seemingly all is very simple, but I use this wonderful method till now. Imagine that your coat is in a good condition, but maybe in the elbow area or color wore off. You don't want to change the coat for a new, but you want just to make any changes. On a fabric it's possible to make such interesting embroidery. You simply make an incision, making the whole of the form you need, then you will knit on the perimeter by a usual needle with a usual thread to lay a woolen thread that it will be the holder of the wedding threads. At first you process the perimeter, I will show how to make it. Then you take such needle with a woolen thread. The thread can be not woolen, but silk or any interesting. Such gold if the fabric is black, and you lay on the perimeter fixing, so that threads meet in the center. Pay attention, I specially cut out the difficult hole, not round, not square form, though on this form it's much easier to work, because in the square all is symmetric and threads, which will be crossed, will give absolutely even and characteristic pattern. The same thing is in the circle, and I specially took such hull of the wrong form. It's the irregular triangle, thereby having complicated the task, but having made the embroidery much more interesting than it would be if there was a rectangle.
The charm of this method is that it looks very nice from the wrong and from the upper side. There are virtually no upper or wrong sides. And pay attention that we can feel the surface partially. It's not obligatory to make it on a circle. You can have chosen for yourself the convenient side, for example, any sector, to move from right to left, filling it. And it also can be the partial filling, it's not obligatory to make it from the center to perimeter. These air spaces create the illusion of open work. We all stitched up.
The master class is finished. There is nothing more important than peace in the home, and the peace in the home depends on us. All is in our hands. Good luck to new meetings. With you there was Tatiana Lazareva.